see from the air there's some dark looming clouds out here. We really are in for a change very soon. So I'm gonna make the most of this little hour out of it. It's midday now, about 22. So I'll stay out till probably no later than two o'clock. I'll just see how the weather picks up. 18 knots now. Once it starts going 20, 23, I'll start making my way back in. That's just up to 20 now. <laughs> Didn't take long, did it? <laughs> right, we'll have a little run out and see how we go. Uh, there's Minky, sailing herself. You can't see the, the tiller piling. Swells just beginning to build now. They're just up to about a meter here and there. And uh, I'm actually very apprehensive. I feel like I'm just waiting for the wind to pick up for me to turn around and run back in rather than just sitting there and uh, enjoying the sail. Because I know it's going to get rough and I know it's going to pick up soon. Decks then on Minky, and a uh, little bit bouncy out here. Like I said, the swells are starting to pick up just a little bit. Um, nothing to worry about, really. Um, she's still close hauled, still into the tide, still on one sail. I'll show you some instruments. Hang on, let's see if we can come up here. Oh, look, we seem to have slowed a little bit now. It will be the influence of the tide. So, if I can see if I can pull that out a little bit. See, we've got 15 knots there, 14 knots of, of wind. That's our wind speed. And uh, there's the, the speed over ground. It's just on four knots. Uh, and you can tell by that, we're just, we're just close hauled there on a port tack at the moment. And like I said, just on one sail. So, um, not too far away, really. I think, we'll come back down below so you can see me. I think I'll uh, I'll stay out for a little bit longer, another half an hour or so, and then I'll turn around and go back. And that'll take me another hour and a bit to get back then. So just having a little bit of fun because I haven't been out there for ages and I've been missing my little boat and um, missing the sailing. It's amazing how addicted I am to it. So uh, I just thought I'd give it a thrash about before the uh, before the really strong winds come again, like we've had over the last couple of days. That's uh, that's George, the autopilot sailing the boat and uh, thanks to Ian for naming that when he was on the boat last Friday there you go so it's been George ever since and probably will be forever more and as you can see by Tilly it's right in the middle there which is good news so there's uh, there's not much weather helm a bit bouncy there's not much weather helm and there's not much lee helm neither sitting beautifully so nothing George can't handle just the way it should be